This time we're going to focus on something embarrassing that happened to you in the past. In our first video we focused on the fear of looking foolish which is a future focus thing. Now we're going to focus on something that you were embarrassed about in the past. Could be, and it doesn't matter how far in the past, could be something that happened in school, could be happen, something that happened last week. Just something where you felt embarrassed and ashamed of what happened. Uh, now same as last time, you want to think about a specific event and you might want to write down a title for that event. It might be that school thing or my teacher thing or my mother thing, whatever it is that caused you that embarrassment and rate the intensity on a scale from 0 to 10, where 10 is very embarrassed, still a lot of intensity around it, to 0 being no, no embarrassment about it when you think about it. So once you've identified your event, then we'll start tapping again. So coming back to that karate chop point on the side of the hand and repeating after me. Even though I'm embarrassed when I think about what happened that time, I choose to accept myself anyway. Even though I'm embarrassed about what happened that time, I acknowledge how I feel. Even though I'm embarrassed about what happened in that situation, I want to accept myself anyway. So that's our set up phrase. And now we go back onto the reminder phrase as we go through the points. So back up to the top of the head. The, the embarrassment I feel about what happened. Coming down to the eyebrows. The embarrassment I feel about what happened. Coming into the side of the eyes. The embarrassment I feel about what happened. Come around under the eyes, the embarrassment I feel about what happened. Top lip, the embarrassment I feel about what happened. Chin point, the embarrassment I feel about what happened. Come up to those collarbone points again, nice and high, right underneath the collarbones. The embarrassment I feel about what happened. Under the arms, the embarrassment I feel about what happened. And remember any big sighs or yawns are a good sign of energy shifting and all that old embarrassment moving through you. Last point we're going to use, the inside of the wrist, cross one over the other. The embarrassment I still feel when I think about that situation. And we'll continue straight on into another round. Remember you don't have to repeat the setup if you're going to continue on through the points. So back up to the top of the head. The embarrassment I still feel when I think about that situation. Come down to the eyebrows. All this remaining embarrassment I still feel. Come down to the side of the eyes. All this remaining embarrassment I still feel. Under the eyes, all this remaining embarrassment I still feel. Top lip, all this remaining embarrassment I still feel. Chin point, all this remaining embarrassment I still feel. Collarbones, all this remaining embarrassment I still feel. Enjoy those sighs and yawns as they come up. Under the arms, all this remaining embarrassment I still feel. Inside the wrists again, all this remaining embarrassment I still feel. Now we've done two rounds there, so check in. Bring that memory to mind again. Does it still feel the same? Has it gone up, gone down, changed in some way? 
check in on that memory, put another intensity on it. If, this, if it's still above zero, just repeat a few more rounds. Tapping through, you might want to create a new setup if the emotion has changed in some way. Maybe it was embarrassment, now you just feel a bit sad about it or disappointed. Whatever that new emotion is, create a new setup phrase and then repeat more and more EFT. The more tapping you do, the better it gets. I look forward to seeing you in the next video.